Hello, and welcome to the tutorial for On Off, an app available in iOS and Android markets. Okay guys, so before we open the app, let me tell you really quickly about the difference of On Off and you, your usual carrier. Most carriers provide a SIM card for the phone that calls, messages, and voicemails can be made with. However, On Off does not provide a SIM card, but uses your phone's pre-existing SIM card and the plan that you pay for to make calls, send messages, and use voicemails around the world. This way, you can have multiple lines on one SIM card. The first thing that we see when we open the app is a list of numbers available for purchase immediately. All we have to do is click on a number, purchase it, and we can call from it the second we own it. If we look at the drop-down, you can even choose multiple countries you can purchase a number from. In a drop-down menu, we can select what country we want our number from, and when we select for the United States, we can see that we can even put in an area code to choose numbers from specific states. And when we go into other countries and select type, we see three options, regular, premium, and elite. Each of these options gives us a different type of number that might be easier to remember for some users. So when they select elite, they'll be given a much easier number to remember for a slightly higher fee. And don't stress guys, no matter how long you have the number for, as long as you keep paying the monthly fee, it's yours. It can't be taken away from you. And when we view my account here, we see that I have four sections of four numbers, one for each country, France, Canada, US, and UK, that I can customize with a different color, a different name, but at the same time be reached on any number of them through one phone. And I have complete freedom of how I choose to turn these numbers on and off. For instance, I can turn my French number off and then back on again, just like airplane mode on your regular phone. And like the app suggests, I can turn one number off, two numbers off, or all of my numbers off at once. On-off also gives you total flexibility with how you turn your calls, messages, and voicemails on or off, which is a feature that no carrier today provides. If you click calls, you can turn your calls off. Say you're in a meeting and you only want to receive messages and you don't want to be disturbed, you can turn your calls and your voicemails off so that you only SMS messages are available. But when you turn your messages off, it doesn't mean that your messages just get deleted. They are still sent from anyone that sends you a message. They just don't get delivered until you turn your messages back on with the app. When we open the phone section of on-off, we see a very familiar layout as on-off mimics your pre-existing iPhone or Android phone layout by providing you a section for calls, messages, voicemails, and syncing contacts from your phone. And when you open up your voicemail section, you have all the same options as you would on a normal phone. Speaker, read to read, or just general deleting of your messages. Just like your phone, your contacts can have favorites, photos, and additional contact information such as different emails or different phone numbers for work and home to customize to yourself. Now say you have multiple numbers in multiple countries and you only want to view your voicemails, messages, and calls for one of those numbers. You can color code your countries by number to label one color for France, one color for US, one color for Canada, and one color for UK so that by selecting one of the colors you get your voicemails, messages, and calls just for that specific phone line. Now let's say you want a way to filter your contacts through multiple phone lines by favoriting each of your contacts, giving them a star, and selecting the favorite button in the top right corner, you can do just that. When selecting the favorite button, you can see all of your favorited contacts, all of their messages, calls, and voicemails, and when unselecting, you go right back to your normal call logs. On-off also offers some very usual options where you can create contacts within the app instead of just syncing from your phone 
and also record a voicemail or set a preset recorded voicemail for your calls. But don't stress guys, no matter if you take your SIM card out and put a new one in, the numbers are reachable through the on-off app and aren't linked directly to your SIM card. So no matter what phone or what SIM card you use, all of these numbers are still available. One of the great advantages of on-off is the fact that everything is all accessible inside the app. So by opening the app in multiple devices, whether it's your phone, iPad, or desktop computer, you can access your voicemail, calls, and messages through anywhere. In order to log on on a different device, just go to the settings, log out of the app, download the app on a new device, and log on. And instantly you'll get your voicemails, calls, and messages uploaded to that phone, and we'll use that phone's SIM card to make calls from that point on. On-off is currently available on only one device at a time, so when you log on to another device, you are automatically logged off on another. However, the new version of on-off intends to be able to log on on multiple devices at the same time, including your web page and desk browser. What's truly great about on-off is that if you lose your phone or if your phone dies, you can just log on on a different phone and your messages, voicemails, calls, and contacts are immediately uploaded. When making a call with on-off, you are given an option to choose which of your numbers to call a number with whether it's your French, US, Canadian, or UK number. When calling another number with on-off, you are first given the option to choose which of your numbers to call with. Before a contact has been called, it's gray. But when you assign a specific number to call, it adopts the color of that number. So if I select the USA number, which is in blue, and then call the contact, the contact becomes blue and will remain blue for as long as I decide. I can even go back down and pick a category manually to change which number calls that number. Let's show an example. If I click on Cassandra here, we see that she's already linked to my Canadian cell phone number. But if I go down and assign her to a different category, say French, she is now linked so that my French number will call her whenever I want. So let's give her a call. When we press call, we see that on off already starts contacting your initial phone line and connects you to your service. Then once you're connected, you no longer need to be connected to any wireless or data connection and can freely call through your own phone's plan. Now let me tell you about some of the incredibly revolutionary and new things that on-off has to offer. When we navigate back to the main menu, we see something that is completely unique to the US market and has just been released in French markets only a few weeks ago. It's called virtual portability and when we select the number porting option, we can see what it is. Say you have already multiple phone numbers and you want to keep the phone numbers that you have so that people can reach you, but you don't want to pay for all of your SIM cards and all of your plans that comes with those phone numbers. With OnOff's virtual portability, instead of purchasing one of OnOff's numbers, you can enter your phone number in area code and import your pre-existing phone number without having to change a SIM card over to a new phone so that you can access that phone through on off anywhere in the world. So now users have the opportunity to have multiple phone numbers on a single SIM card without paying for multiple plans. But keep in mind guys, this option is not yet available within the US. Now let's look at another cool feature that on off has to offer. By opening our SMS messages, and typing in a message. When we hold down send, we have the option to preset a time for when the message is to be sent. A good example of how this might be useful is if you get home late and you have a lot of messages from the day, but you don't want to wake anyone by responding to them immediately, you can type out your response and then preset the message for the morning so that you can sleep well and it will get sent to them at a reasonable time. But don't worry guys, for preset timed messages, you still have total flexibility, where you can delete a message before the preset time, and if you want, hold down the send key and send it anytime you want. On off gives you the full flexibility to customize any one of your numbers or contacts in any which way you want by giving it a color, additional contact information, or changing the name entirely. 
OnOff has also integrated social media into the confines of the app, where just like Facebook and WhatsApp, you can friend another person with OnOff, view each other's profile, and then freely send calls, messages, and video calls to another person with the app. But an advantage that OnOff has that these other apps don't quite have is that with multiple phone lines, you can add multiple friends on each line so they can only see one of your profiles. And when you send and receive calls to another person with on-off, your contacts are the first thing they see. So the color, the number, and even your profile picture is shown. Last thing, guys. I'm going to show you a feature that may or may not be applicable to your life, but is certainly an interesting one. It's called Stealth Mode where you can decide if you don't want anyone viewing your personal information on an on-off device to select your number and select stealth mode by turning it on, putting in a password, verifying that password, so that all of the information associated with that number, as well as the number, will disappear. Once you activate stealth mode, you can see a little icon shows up next to your number that says hide. When we click on the hide button, that number instantly disappears, and all of the information, calls, voicemails, and text messages disappear along with it. The only thing you need to do to get back out of stealth mode is by pulling down your main menu. Stealth mode password will come up, put it in, and then instantly everything returns. And regardless of whether you already have a number hidden or not, that password will still come down. So you can put the password for one number, multiple numbers, or have different password for each of your numbers. And when we go to the dial pad and want to make a normal call to a number that we've never called before, we'll still be given the option to choose which of our numbers we want to call it with. That's it, guys. Thank you for listening to the on-off tutorial for iOS and Androids. Keep in mind that as on-off telecom, we think your feedback is valuable and are constantly updating the app according to what our users want. That's it. Let's turn off the app and have a good day.